In this video tutorial, we are going to look at how to create modules within your Canvas online course. You'll notice that uh, from your home page and looking at the navigation down the left hand side, there is a link here that says modules. When I click on modules, it will take me to a list of all the modules that I have created. Several things about modules. First of all, um, each one of these is a separate module and a module can be used to gather activities, resources, assignments, quizzes, discussions. All these different pieces of the module can be put together and students can complete these either in a sequential order or they can complete them um, in any order within a given time frame. You'll also notice that once you have your module created, there is a little green cloud here. And so if I do not want students to see this module, I can simply unpublish the module. And even though there's components within the module that are pub published, then this module is actually unpub unpublished. So let's take a look at that. If I click the triangle in front, I notice that there are several items within here. These green items show that they are published, but since the module itself is not published, students will not be able to see these. This helps because once you're ready to, to give this module out to your students, all you have to do is publish here and the students can see the entire module and the pieces that you want them to see once it opens up. You'll notice that uh, here I have added several pages. This little icon is for a wiki page. Uh, the little Q would mean that it is a quiz and the little A tells me that it is an assignment. And of course, discussions could be added in here as well. Um, all of these pieces have been put in for the students to complete. I can collapse the module back down if I want to. Um, I can move modules very easily by just uh, getting this little four-headed arrow, and I can switch these around into any order uh, that I want those to be within my page. Now let's look at how to add a module to this that's new that we can start putting components into. So first of all, we're going to look in the top right hand corner and we're going to click on the add module button and we're going to name the module. And so I know that this one is going to be unit three, respecting others work. Notice that I can lock the module and also notice that I can set prerequisites. So I could come in here and add a pre prerequisite that says unit one has to be completed before they can get to unit uh, three. And I can add another prerequisite that they must complete unit two before they start unit three. So if you want students to complete modules in a sequential order, uh, you can add prerequisites into the module. Then you just simply add the module and you notice that out to the right it shows you that there are prerequisites before starting this module. Right now, I can see that nothing is added to this module, and we'll look at that in a future video. Thank you.